Hello, so in today's video, we will be seeing how to take live trades directly through the option chain on Stolo itself, right? So yes, let's get started. So first thing you would uh, have to do is you would have to connect your broker, right? So as you can see here, I've connected uh, Upstocks as my broker here. So if you want to see how to connect your um, uh, broker, you can uh, head over to our YouTube channel or you can head over to help.stolo.in and you would see uh, broker integrations here right you can simply click on that and uh you can find your broker for example if you're using done you can simply click on done here and we would have an uh video to uh show you how to connect done and take live trades directly right so uh you can either do it through help.stolo.in or you can directly head over to our youtube channel and find your specific uh broker right? and see how to integrate it right so uh live trade itself on uh stolo you can do it to, uh, through three terminals one is the uh, option chain second is the intraday terminal and also you can directly trade through the scalping terminal right so these are the three terminals today we would be uh, covering option chain uh, itself and the other two terminals we would uh, uh, surely be launching videos on that as well right so you can uh, surely check out the youtube uh, channel which is Stolo and you would uh, see the other videos as well so uh, yes coming to the option chain itself so uh, yes many of you had requested di di directly trading through the option chain because you get tons of data here itself right so for example here you have your strike you have your live LTP uh, data of each strike uh, uh, you have your OI data, you have your volume data, implied volatility data, and also your option Greeks itself, right? We also give you your build up trend and you can choose what you would like to see according to the trader you are, right? So for example, here you, you can uh, toggle on or off uh, anything that you don't use. For example, let's say if you don't use uh, Gamma and Vega, you can simply toggle it off and save the changes here itself, right? And uh, in order to see how to exactly understand the uh, option chain and how to use it to understand my market direction, you can start, uh, surely click on this question mark here. And if you scroll down a little, we have uh, videos to help you understand how to use the option chain itself, right? So uh, once you've done that, uh, there are two uh, ways to basically buy uh, or sell uh, through the option chain directly, right? So one is um, you would be able to see uh, buy and sell here directly next to the strike. If you're not able to uh, see it, you can head over to the settings here and simply toggle this on, right? So once this is on, you would be able to see the buy and sell directly. So uh, that is one way you can also click on uh, any of the strikes and you would be able to see individual uh, uh, that specific strikes call and put uh, graph here and on hover you can also see how the price movements have been right you also have your OHLC values and you can directly again buy or sell uh, from here as well so for example we can surely take a trade here right so I'll just take uh, I'll just hedge a trade I'll take both on one on the call side one on the put side as well right so for example here 22,500 call side I can simply click on buy right and here you can enter the quantity for example if I enter 100 quantity here you can choose between market and limit order I'll take a market order and uh, similarly you can choose between MIS or normal order right so I'll take a MIS order and click on buy so as soon as you have done that you can see that the, it would directly come into the uh, order management window here right or the trade widget right so similarly i'll take one on the uh put side as well and i'll just take a similar quantity market order mis and click on buy right so as soon as you do that you would be able to see your trades on this uh, widget directly right so you would be able to see your funds that is the margin available you can see your trade book uh, on terms of uh, what are the trades you have taken since morning for example the latest order we are taken was at 12.55. We are taken at 20, uh, 1,950 PE. You can see that the status is complete. It was a buy order of 100 quantity and the price we entered at was 38.2, right? And this message column is if there is, for example, any error message, it would come here, right? Uh, open orders is uh, if there is any open order, right? For example, let's say 22,300, we just click on buy. We add it as a limit order and we say that, we want to buy this when the price comes to 10, right? And if I click on buy, 
you would be able to see that uh, this comes in the open order because it's not yet live, right? So you can see that, uh, you can see the time we place this order at, you can see the status. Uh, and as soon as this has been triggered, it would directly come into the positions tab, right? So for example, I'll just uh, close it because I just wanted to show you what open orders is. And if you come to the position, you would be able to see the uh, positions you have taken live, right? So on the left side, you can see the symbol that is 22,500 CE. It was a buy order. You can directly see the um, specific strikes uh, chart here itself. You can also uh, add quantity, right? So if you want to add quantity, um, for it, you can directly add it from here or you can uh, from the option chain also buy it, right? You can add a target and stop loss, which I'll show you in a minute. And you would see all your um, orders data here, right? For example, the uh, open quantity for the order is 100, the entry price, the last traded price, and you can also see the points captured, right? So you have, uh, for example, this 22,500 CE has captured 0.4 points and you can see the PNL here itself, right? You also have your actions, which is exit button uh, here. You can also partially exit, right? Now, because uh, I've taken two lots here, you can see that uh, I can exit even 50%. That is one lot here, right? So that is uh, your, your complete uh, order management itself. And I can quickly add a stop loss, right? So my if I just click on stop loss here, you can see uh, LTP is 37. I'll just enter my stop loss at 34, right? And uh, I'll show you what manual trailing stop loss is as well, right? So currently uh, the increment decrement point is set at one and I can set, click on set stop loss. So here you can see that I can, there's a plus minus button on click of minus, it would go to 33 on click of plus, it would come back to 34, right? So you can manually increment, decrement your stop loss, right? And you can trail your stop loss. Uh, similarly, for the same order, you can also add a target, right? So the LTP is 35. I can simply add a target of 40 here. And similarly, uh, as you saw in the stop loss, you can manually trail your uh, target as well, right? And you can see here, you have set it for both stop loss and target now. So whichever hits first, it would exit the position, right? So uh, that is how you set a target and stop loss here as well, and how you would manage your order, right? So for now, I will exit uh, all the trades and on confirm, yes, all my trades are exited and you can click on history and just uh, refresh once you would like, and you would see all the trade taken since morning, right? And you can also analyze it directly in the uh, side view here itself. So you can see how the trades have been uh, going since morning, your overall stats, the total trades you have taken, the average points you have captured, total profitable trades, total loss trades. And uh, this is the overall you can also see for your individual trades as well, right? For example, here, uh, we are taken uh, the, uh, 21,950p, we were in the trade for three minutes, 34 seconds. We made a profit of 160 here. And you can see your entry price, your exit price, the amount of points you captured, the quantity you had taken for the trade. And also if you want to see the chart here, you can directly see it here itself, right? And uh, the, you can also see the DTO PNL, that is the PNL until this trade was uh, uh, specifically taken itself, right? So uh, that is how uh, you would trade through the option chain directly. So yes, uh, hope you understood how to take trades on Stolo. And uh, yes, we will be covering the other two terminals in an other video, right? So hope you uh, uh, understood this completely. If you have any doubts, please make sure to comment below and we will uh, surely help you out. Thank you.